morning, Panthers. Good morning, Panthers. Good morning, Panthers. Good morning, Panthers. Good morning, family. My name is Lana. Hey, Panthers, and I'm Ellie. Today is Tuesday, February 20th. Today is an A day. Today's win time is B day block three. Please stand and join me for the Pledge of Allegiance. Please remain standing for the moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The weather for today will be mostly cloudy. The high temperature will be 55 degrees. There is no chance of rain today. The moon phase is a waxing gibbous moon. Happy birthday today to everyone who celebrated a birthday over the long weekend. Jackson Whitmire, Emery Perkins, Timel Edwards, Bianca Van Leuveny, Alyssa Van Leuveny, and Abigail Briel. According to National Today, today is National Love Your Pet Day. Today we embrace one special tradition that makes us human, our love of our pets. There are many things that differentiate humans from the rest of the animal kingdom, but one of the more usual behaviors is our long-standing tenderness to keep our animals as pets. According to Wise Mavericks Pet Ownership's statistics, about 57% of American households own at least one pet. It only makes sense to commemorate something that is so important to many people. Library Bingo and Comedy Wildlife are due February 29th. Reminder, charge those computers each and every night. Concert Band will meet after school today from 3 to 4. The Robotics and Manufacturing Club will meet tomorrow and every Wednesday this month. The treble course will meet after school today and the following Tuesday after school from 3 to 4. The yearbook club will meet tomorrow at 2.45 in room C11. Interested instrumentalist and vocalist, the James A. Band Scholarship Competition will be held on Saturday, March 9th. You will you must be applied by March 1st. Visit the Smithfield Lions Club website or Mr. Franklin for further information. The Teens for Christ Club will meet Thursday at 710 in Miss Gardner's Chorus Room. 8th grade girls softball trials are today through Thursday. The book fair opens on Friday. Be sure to save your money for some exciting books headed your way. Parents can also set up an e-wallet online. Seamus Hammock to turn in your dog man pre-order payments so that you can be one of the very first readers of this new book. The cost is $14.99. Online payments are also accepted. Payments are due March 13th. Don't forget the Kid Win Art Contest entries are due on March 22nd. See Ms. Joyner for more information. Panther Spotlight is Danny Hensley. Mr. Rosetta nominated her because Danny is an amazing student and kid. She has a huge heart and is always helpful without needing to be asked. She is at an absolute pleasure to have as a student. Let's see what the cafeteria will be serving for lunch today. Today is Tech Tuesday. Today we will highlight the inventor of the elevator, Alexander Miles, in honor of Black History. In today's Black History Month fact, we're recognizing an inventor who made it a lot safer to ride on elevators. As Fox 43's Trinice Bishop tells us, without him, we'd have to manually open and close those elevator doors all on our own. 
For Black History Month, we're shining a bright light on black people whose contributions made our life easier, and in this case, safer. Getting on and off an elevator is no big deal, right? Well, it wasn't for most of the 1800s, and that's all because of this amazing man, Alexander Miles. In 1887, Alexander Miles patented his design for improving the automatic opening and closing of shaft elevator doors. Before Miles' invention, both doors had to be opened and closed manually, and if someone forgot to close the shaft door, other passengers could fall down the shaft when expecting to step into the elevator. But with the Miles creation, the doors did not open while the elevator was moving. Alexander Miles was a man of many talents. He was a barber and he invested in real estate as well, making him one of the wealthiest men in the Northwest. In 2007, Miles was inducted into the National Inventors Hall of Fame. And that's the Panther Up for today. Please recite the school essentials with me. Today we'll walk the Panther way. We'll show kindness, earn respect, take responsibility, be of service, and work as a team. Have a great day, family, and don't forget to walk the Panther way every day. The treble chorus will meet after school today and following Tuesdays after school from it's 3 me. to 4. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> I'm like looking at you. I'm like, yeah, just no, stop. I'm sorry. Okay. Go up. No, no, no down. 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 I'm on my phone. <laughs> the answer. The, 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 the instru- the- Lana. No. Interested. <laughs> instrumentalists. <laughs> Interested in instrumentalists. Yeah, that's sorry. Okay. <laughs> Mr. Kid Nam- Kid. Wrong teacher. My fault. I don't know where I got Mr. Kid from. <laughs> Oh, no. 